Welcome back to the Open Stadium here in Spitaklave. This is day three of the Climate Cup powered by Power Grid, Asia's only football tournament at 11,000 feet altitude. This is the last group game. It is between Tibetan NSA in black and one Ladakh in red. The winner of this clash will meet Delhi FC in the final. Final is to be played on the 7th of September. Both teams have a lot on the line. Welcome back guys, we are here at the Spituk Open Stadium Lay for the pre-match presentation of one sort of a qualifier between One Ladakh FC and Tibetan NSA. Both teams are on three points and whoever wins today or like takes the lead goes to the final against Delhi FC. We have with us our prediction machine who was wrong against me in one match. Musab, what are your thoughts on today's match? Well, it's going to be an interesting match today Kabir. We have two teams who have very good attacking sides and uh, talking about Tibet, you know, they lost one game against Delhi but they uh, prevailed in the next game against uh, UT. But last game for One Ladakh, it was a tough game against Delhi but this time I think today One Ladakh will prevail and they will win the match. Yeah, I think the same because they have a physical advantage and I see their substitutions are being started today. So that is a different kind of tactic, right? Uh, I think, yeah, you know, they have two strikers uh, who mainly played in the second half of the match. But today they will start, I think they will have to start. And talking about uh, climate advantage, you know, we also have Tibet. They also come from a higher altitude. And uh, let's see what happens today, Kabir. Yeah, I think uh, teams are getting ready for kickoff, so let's not get it between our viewers. Um, over to you, Suraj, in commentary box. Let's go to the kickoff. And we're ready for kickoff. Both teams. The final instructions. Ready with the toss, both skippers. Emma Lundup in black. And the skipper for one Ladakh, Tanzin Sepak, number 18. It'll be very interesting to see the approach of both teams, how they approach this game. Here's starting 11 for one Ladakh FC. Number 48, Mohammad Hamad. Number 11, Arif Hussain. Number 19, stands in Wangdan. Number 15, Sering Dorje. Number 99, Astra Rebar. Number 50, Subair Bashir. Number 22, Sevang Nobu. Number 49, Atib Ahmad Dar. Number 18, the skipper, Tanzin Sepak. Number 29, Mehran Hilal Dar. And number 33, Furkan Ahmad Dar. Yeah, 
have a look at the substitute. Uh, this is Tibetan NSA. It's their team. Number 14, Penpa Sering. Number 13, Hongdak Dorji. Number 10, Skipper, Pema Lundup. Number 27, Sultram Daba. Number 2, Gawang Chokli. Number 17, Tenzin Sering. Number 4, Tenzin Dondup. Number 5, Tenzin Dondun. Number 12, Tenzin Segyal. Number 59, Tenzin Samdup. And number 6, Tenzin Namgyal. this battle will face Delhi FC who have been rampant in this Climate Cup 2023 tournament they dispatched T. Ladakh 10-0 earlier this morning they really set the marker so they know the winner of this match has got a tough challenge ahead of them Almost ready for kickoff here at the open stadium. Referee making sure he's got everything in check. And we're off and underway. Tibetan NSA kicking off from right to left. See both teams will be very, very, wouldn't say nervous, I'd say it's going to be more that nervous excitement rather than just pure nerves. You have to enjoy football, give the crowds and the viewers a wonderful game. It's a good win here from Ron Ladakh trying to push forward really quickly. And the skipper just calming things down, finding the ball. Tenzin Dondup. But he's given away inexplicably. And one Ladakh have a chance early on. The shot just dragged wide. It can be very, very comfortable. It's a reminder that a loss of concentration, even for a single moment, could be very, very crucial. One Ladakh getting the shot early, courtesy of that mistake. Tibetan NSA will be hoping that they don't make mistakes such as this going forward trying maneuver that on the right hand side that's really well done good player the skipper Pema Lundup can that midfield role orchestrating things and the ball is won once again high up the pitch by Van Ladakh they move on to the left hand side it's a good defensive block and it is a corner for Van Ladakh the first of the game crucial block there by Tenzin Namgyal And one Ladakh here have a chance to load the box early. Mehran Hilal Dahu plays a very short corner. Scuffs the ball back and it's very, very sloppy. Just a miscommunication. They wanted to play it short. But one Ladakh missed their opportunity. And Tibetan NSA can once again now reset. It's a good play here. Onto the right hand side. Just try to flick that on quickly. It's a good play. Tibetan NSA, and they can make their move here. Jigmin Namgyal trying to run away from the keeper. He's done really well to pass it. He's got the ball back. Again, very patient play. But Tibetan NSA, the ball is whipped into the box. There's a lot of space here on the left hand side. He keeps it in. He does. He's done really well. Ball into the box. It's a good header out. Tibetan can once again. Restart, but on Ladakh winning the ball back once again. Counter attack is on. It's on the left hand side. Three bodies in attack and support. There's a good pass there, but there's nobody at the far stick. And it is a missed opportunity and a goal kick. Bright start by one Ladakh. Really breaking with pace on the counter attack. Good play out here. On to the right hand side. I think it was Sultram Dava out. Try to pick the pass. Find his teammate, Tenzin Sering, on the right hand side. 
nice bit of footwork. It's a good turn in midfield. Ken looks up for the big switch, and he has found him brilliantly, but he has just managed not to keep the ball in. Astra Rebar on the right hand side, just missed controlling it. Wang Chokli with the throw in. It's a good turn there, but he's lost possession. Again, a very, very dangerous place to lose possession. That time it was Tenzin Namgyal who took the chance. It's the big switch out to the left hand side. It's well defended. Van Ladakh, Tibetan can once again now reload and make the move. Wang Dak Dorji. Tenzin Namgyal takes the switch on to the right hand side. Tenzin Dondin just lost the ball there. It's a good tackle there by Pema Lundup. Really good captain's interception. There's a throw in for Tibetan NSA. Tenzin Namgyal put under a lot of pressure. Now one Ladakh can break forward once again. Plenty of support and attack. They have to be patient, but he's gone for the shot instead. It's easily gathered by Tenzin Sandup. It's a long launch there. It's gone from goalkeeper to goalkeeper. Now Mama Damad now. That left center back roll. Long clearance by the goalkeeper. It's a good header. Again, it's Van Ladakh. Good combination play. It's the left hand side. Samad now again. Good pass. Van Ladakh really popping the ball about with a lot of confidence. It's a very loose giveaway in the middle of the park. Sultram Dava picking the ball up. Here's the skipper, Pema Lundup. Lovely bit of play on the right hand side. Then just lacking a bit of composure. Tibetan will once again reload. It's a good pass there. Try to feed the ball quickly. Wang Chokli had played the ball into midfield, but the ball was played onto the left hand side. Very, very rushed. It might be the nerves early on. And then Sepak just plays it back to the goalkeeper, Kana Maddar. Mohamed Ahmad now onto the left hand side. Good bit of play, she tries to loop the ball in. He's onside, it's a good ball. But he isn't onside, it is offside. Right idea. There's the vice captain, Tenzin Dondon. He's organizing the back line. And then with the free kick has gone straight back to the keeper, Namadar. KG start to the game. There are mistakes popping up. Ball to the left hand side, but it is easily gathered by the goalkeeper. Now, one Ladakh will make their way forward. Good control on the chest. Plays it off brilliantly. Lundup plays it on to the right hand side. Once again, restart. It's a good tackle there by Wang Dak Dorji. Plays it off to Pema Lundup. Here's Namgyal. Under a lot of pressure, he has to be very careful, and he has lost the ball out. Wang Ladakh. 
Now inching forward. It's a good tackle there. On Asra Rebar. It's a good pass. Once again, is he onside? But he isn't. It's very close. On that far left hand side. Here's Namgyal now looks up. Has to find the pass again. It's both teams are looking for that long diagonal. And Afghan Ahmadar to deal with that. It's awkward. The ball just landed to him. It's very good covering back. Now to again the battle in midfield. Very congested. Mahmud again going for that long raking diagonal pass. Both teams are looking th at that as a weapon of choice. Quickly switching the play out to the opposite flank. This is a free kick here for one Ladakh. Here's Mehran Halaldar standing over the free kick. Long way out, so he'll be looking to just float this one in to the back stick. He's gone for goal instead. It's well over the crossbar. Disappointing end to that sequence of play. Don't know if he was aiming for the far post, he just miscued it. Regardless, that's a very strange header. And it will start once again. Very risky pass. Once again, both teams just giving the ball away in crucial areas. Tibet and NSA guilty of that on a couple of occasions. Trying to be as precise as possible with their passing. A bit of lapse of concentration can be detrimental. Here's Mohamed Ahmad now. Switches it to the left back. It's a good bit of play here. Again, they're looking for that combination play. He's kept it in brilliantly. Well played there on the left hand side. He looks for the shot and it's a brilliant save. F outstretched arm. Tens in Samdub. They come again once again. It's another save. And they can finally hack it away clear. Wan Ladakh putting the pressure. Tibet and NSA coming away with the pass. And they're now launching their counter-attack now. And the goalkeeper very, very smartly off his line. It's a brilliant save by Tenzin Samdup. Fully stretched. Brilliant. And he was up quickly as well. He had to make that second save soon after. Wan Ladakh. Scan threatening. They're looking very dangerous on the counter attack. It's Aftal Ahmadar, number 49 for one Ladakh. It is a corner for Tibetan NSA. That for a save. Strike. So well hit by Sering Dorje. Set that out to curl in. The goalkeeper had other ideas. Tibet Nanese with the corner. It's the ball into the box. The goalkeeper claims it's very good goalkeeping by Ahmad Dar. Very commanding goalkeeping. Referee just having a word with the goalkeeper, Ahmad Dar. Just trying to figure out what the issue seems to be. Hema Lundup is making his voice heard. The game's back underway. It's very Cheap giveaway once again. Here's Lundup now. It's a good pass. 
and that Georgi is to find the pass, not succeeding. It's a big boot forward. With Ahmad, big header. Again, this game has been played with a lot of intensity. Tibetan come away with the ball. This is really good play. He tries to just push it past the defender. Defender is very wise to that. It's a crucial interception. There's a little space here on the right hand side. If he does find it, Asra Rebar has found the space. He looks up for the pass, but he cannot find his teammate. On Ladakh once again. Able to whip the ball in. It's a commanding header out. And Tibetan NSA get away with that situation. On Ladakh looking very confident. The threat on the counter attack has been ever present since the game has started. It's a good bit of play here by the number 22, Sevang Nobu. Again, the flick up. There's a chance here. It's claimed by the goalkeeper. It might have been offside. But Tenzin Samdup wasn't to know, and he quickly gathers. Long clearance and the ball. It looks to break there, but Ahmad Ahmad doing his defensive duties very diligently. Hacks it clear, taking no chances. As Tibetan NSA will now have the chance for the long throw in, probably load the box. It is Kamang Chokli who will take this throw in. So in the flick on header, there's a chance here. There's another chance, it's not cleared, it is cleared now. Nervy moment there for one Ladakh. Hack clear at the right time. Shokli once again with the throw in. Again, the flick on header. This time does not break to a Tibetan player, and one Ladakh will clear. Let's see, Tibetan NSA have three players behind just in case the counter attack from that throw in happens. It's a very pragmatic play. Sultan Dava just letting the ball go out for the throw in. Chokli. It's a long throw into the box. It's a good header there by Hamad. It's hacked clear by Asra Rebar. Tibetan just trying to launch a quick break here. Dr. Doji battling. It's again booted up the field. It's again a very, very loose touch there by Tenzin Dondup. Rebar keeps it in. He looks up to play the cross in. He's asking for the handball. Kamang Chokli is holding his face. The call has been given as a handball and a free kick for one Ladakh. Kamang Chokli probably had his hands extended above his body frame. The linesman. No doubt, that was a free kick. It's an interesting position for Asra Rebar. Almost like a corner kick. He's taken a few yards ahead of it. Ahmad Dar in conversation with Rebar. Ahmad Dar would probably be wise to get into the box, which he does. Just making sure the Tibetan players are at the right spot. Rebar ready for the free kick. Dangerous position here. It's a good ball in. It's a header. It's flicked on, but there's no one there. The fast take to tap it home. The ball again into the box. It's a good header out. 
with the Tibetan players. So he's the edge of the box. On his left foot, he goes for the strike. It's well blocked once again. Tibetan clear the lines. Paul Zubair Bashir with the strike on his left foot. Good defending by Tibetan NSA. He's kept it in. If he has, he's done phenomenally well. Tibetan Lawan Ladakh have players in the support. But it's a disappointing end to that attack. Should have done more there. So now Tibetan will play out the back. Again, a disappointing giveaway. A lot of loose passes in critical areas. It's a crunching challenge. Referee just trying to keep control of this game. Challenge was heavy. Just to see whether he got the ball first or the man. Was saying Dorje with the challenge. Should be okay to continue. Mangdak Dorji. Mm, Tibetan NSA take this free kick. Chokli, um, it isn't. It is done then. They start the free kick, they go short. Good footwork there on the right hand side. Here's Lundup. He's intercepted brilliantly by Mamund Ahmad, but it is given as a foul. I'm not sure that was a foul. Again, the one Ladakh players they have to show discipline here. This tournament has seen quite a few red cards. The last thing they want in a must-win game as such as this. As you can see, it's a Mohamed Ahmad clearly won the ball first and then catches Pema Lundup. The referee he missed that first action and saw Ahmad catching the skipper Lundup there. It's going to be a free kick for Tibetan, a dangerous area. Again, the order of business will be to whip it in to that far post. Referee just making sure the wall is placed correctly. Lundup ready with the free kick. Ball whipped into the box. It's a free chance and it's a big miss there. He's and what a chance for Tibetan NSA to open the scoring. It was a brilliant ball in by Pema Lunda. Put on a plate. The player on the far post could not make contact. If he had gotten the right amount of contact, I'm sure it was a goal. It's one Ladakh's chance now to breathe a huge sigh of relief. It's good tracking back. It's very combative in that middle area of the pitch. There's a chance on the left hand side now. Again, lovely bit of play. Great one too here. He can look for the shot. He was unselfish and it's a great chance and it's 1 0 to 1 Ladakh. Open the scoring. It is Sering Dorje, to whom the ball broke so kindly. And the finish it was really composed. I just had to hit the target. And he did with consummate ease, giving one Ladakh the crucial opening goal. You can see ball just broke. Setting Dorje. Making no mistake, there was an overload of players. And one Ladakh punishing the indecisiveness of Tibetan NSA's defending. But again, comes from really good play out wide, keeping the ball in tight areas. And one Ladakh just at the stroke of the water break, 
Open the scoring. 23 minutes on the clock. It's one Ladakh one to beat an NSA nil. Back underway after the quick drinks break. Tibetan NSA will now have to chase this game. It's a good flip of play there on the right hand side. This was a foul, but referee says play on. It's a very loose giveaway. Tibetan NSA now come away with the ball. This is Penpa Sering finds the pass onto the right hand side and Tenzin. Sering just not able to keep the ball in. Mohamed Ahmad standing on the ball. Back to the goalkeeper, Samdup. Back to Hamad. Again, one Ladakh now, just keeping composure. Bring the ball from side to side. They have the crucial opening goal. And what is essentially a knockout fixture. Space here on the right hand side. It's good play here. Here's Ribar. Again, great feet. Beats Chokli there. It's a good extended leg there. He tries to whip it in first time. There's another chance for Foran Ladakh, and it's just wide. Big chance. On that left hand side, ball ricocheting off a couple of people. You can see ball breaking. For Aftab Ahmaddar, what the kilted chance of making it 2 0. Again, a good pass, but Mamad Hamad works it out. Well played out the back, attends in Dondon. Here's Sultram Dawa, tries to feed the ball, it's well intercepted. Rebar just winning that free kick, shielding the ball really well. Only seven minutes on the clock. It is and Sepak will take this free kick just in his own half. It's cleared away. It's a good touch. Try and move the ball into midfield. 
again touch is a little heavy could it be the awkward bubble off the turf you can see some of the passing today it's not been as crisp as both teams would have liked it but this one is a sensational ball over the top it's done really well to keep the ball in Tibetan come away with the ball it's a sharp turn it's asking for the free kick So sharp turn on the right hand side. See, Tendon Sering just made that move as quickly as possible, but he was caught. Better now, once again, playing out the back. He's taking a few chances. You can see. Arif Hussain almost keeping the ball in. These are risky situations that Tibetan NSA. Again, a long ball. There's no support there from the goalkeeper. Jay Shepard is out of play. He sees a little shove on the back. Goalkeeper Hamadar not happy receiving that shove. No harm done, thankfully. Referee asking one Ladakh to speed things up. Mamad Ahmad now come away with the ball. And very loose touch, needless giveaway, possession. Tenzin Segia will take the throw in. Will look to launch it long, look for that flick on. Just exactly happened. There's a big chance here. He's just lost his footing at a crucial moment. It has been hacked clear. Where Asrar Reba, crucial interception. As Tibetan NSA almost finding a way back into this game. Throw in was excellent. Flick on header. Again, really good header there. It's a big chance for Wang Dak Dorji. Again, losing his footing. It's a corner. Emma will take this corner. Whips it into the box. It's cleared away by Hamad. There's a chance here at the edge of the box. Again, no team taking complete control of the ball. Tibetan NSA have a chance here, but Van Ladak showing a lot of composure, defending that situation. Great control. On the left-hand side by Ahmad Dar. And now Van Ladakh can move forward. Again, a very errant pass. Tenzin Dondin intercepting. The skipper's turn. Give another loose pass. It's Tibetan NSA. Tibetan NSA will be hoping that their talisman, Emma Lundup, will be orchestrating things a little more crisply. Good pressure by Penpa Sering. Van Ladakh now. Moving the ball, a lot more composure. Ahmad on his right foot looks for the big switch, but Chokli clears. To throw in here for one Ladakh. Devang Norbu, number 22, task with the throw in. Thirty-three minutes on the clock, twelve minutes plus added on time for this first half to conclude. This must win game for both teams. Mm. 
Zamudar, Namad playing on the left hand side, asking for the offside. Has arrived the flag, needs to watch the line. Amadar before making that run. Ball has to arrive on time. Steven Segar finds Tanjan Dondok who goes long. It's a good pass there, but referee says play on. It looked like a foul there. Did catch him on the top of his boot. Emil Lundup asking the referee whether that challenge warranted a yellow card. Was indeed Tendon Sering. Got caught there on the top of his boot, but he seems okay to continue. Free kick for Tibetan NSA. Look to launch the ball to the box. It's a good pass there. Tenzin Nangyal was free in the far post, but he wasn't found. Now one Ladakh on the break. Plenty of options there, but Pema Lundup does really well to come away with the ball. It's another loose giveaway in the middle of the park. Lovely pass here in midfield. And then Dorje finding his finger on the left hand side, but it's another loose giveaway. It's been the theme of today's game. Sultram Dava crowded out by 3-1 Ladakh players. That's a lot of composure shown by Asam Raibar. Ladakh asking for the foul, but they can play on here. Doge just feeds it out to the left hand side. No one, Ladakh. Don't have to force the issue here. Keep possession. Move the Tibetan team from side to side before making their move. It's Mahmoud Ahmad now, not being pressed. And plenty of time for the centre backs to pick their pass. This is a very loose play here by Van Ladakh. And they've surrendered possession out of absolutely nothing. It's a disadvantage of all the time in the world as well. You get not too precise. It's a touch there by Sultum Dava. He's asking for the corner kick. And he has gotten it. Is a corner and Tibetan NSA out of absolutely nothing. I won the corner. Van Ladakh will be kicking themselves if they concede from this opportunity. They were in complete control of the situation beforehand. A couple of loose touches by the defenders. Next thing you know, Tibetan NSA. Corner here. Pema Lundup going short. It's a nice bit of play here. Again, a very heavy touch by Sultrum Dava. It is a goal kick. A little bit of pressure. It's a lovely bit of play. I won Ladakh, but ball goes back to the goalkeeper. Amadar taking his time. Yeah, 
nezamádná. And he's not happy. His left winger wanted him to receive the pass. It's a good bit of composure there. Hins and Dunduk. Now one Ladakh can break here. Play it right. There's Rebar. Looks for the pass. There's a big chance here. And straight at the goalkeeper. He had a lot of time. Too much time maybe. To take a touch. But he went for the first time effort. Ahmadar will be very disappointed. He couldn't double on Ladakh's lead. Ongamang Chokli, the throw in. It's found its way. It's gone for the shot. It was very ambitious. Among Dak Doji pulling the trigger way out. So it's go kick. Mohammad Hamad. Goalkeeper just chipping it. It was right back perfectly. Once again, not able to sustain the attack. On Ladakh. Good control there by Dawa. Lovely play by the by Pema Lundup. Looks to play with the outside of his boot. It's a smashing pass, but it's just too much on there for Wang Dak Dorji. The idea was sensational. My Pema Lundup looks up outside of his boot, just cuts across the ball to take the pace off, but skips off the turf. Just a goal kick. Instant control. Raybar on the right hand side. Raybar opting to go all the way back to his goalkeeper. Not taking any chances, not surrendering possession. It's a lovely pass out by the goalkeeper. Now one Ladakh confidently playing the ball around. And as I say that, they give the ball away very, very cheaply. And Dava now can drive. Sultram Dava. Lundu put the ball in. It's a chance here for Tibetan NSA. It's a big chance. It's a great block. Start offside. Sultram Dawa not happy. He was called offside there. Thought he bent his run perfectly. The linesman calling it offside. Again, one Ladakh is making the mistake of giving the ball away very cheaply. Tibetan NSA pouncing upon it. One Ladakh can be the sigh of relief. Start once again. Here's Rebar. Zubair Bashir just looking up to find the pass. He does really well. Just to find the space on the left hand side. He's done extremely well there. Good covering, defending. He's got support. Is that offside? It isn't. Wan Ladakh can zoom. It's a chance here. Left hand side is a big chance. He just toe pokes it into the goalkeeper's hands. Tema Sandup. Very glad that the ball just harmlessly dribbled into his hands. Wan Ladakh looking dangerous in these situations. Now Tibetan can break. They decide to keep possession instead. Java looks up. It's a good pass. You can see three Wan Ladakh players converging on the ball. It's a very, very lonely shift up top for the striker. Tibet Nenese come away with the ball by the throw in. Two minutes plus added on time. It's 
throw in. This was a flick on. Good defending there by Mohamed Ahmad. Puts it all the way back into Tibetan NSA's half. Stands in Dondup. Again, very composed bit of play. Great feet shown. And then just lets himself down. It's an over eager pass. Did the first part really be well. Showing great feet. And wanting to launch that quick pass. And not finding its target. There's Dundup. Lovely pirouette there. He does very well to keep the ball, but then loses control. Referee. He's showing a yellow card here. So it is to number 27, Sulchum Daba. Was it for a challenge or was it for descent? They, they have to keep their heads here, Tibetan NSA. They can't risk getting a red card. The referee. No nonsense approach. Pema Lundup is pleading his case on behalf of his team. There is confirmation that Sultram Daba has picked up the yellow card. Man Ladakh. Look to close this first half, keeping the clean sheet intact. A little bit of confusion there between both Tibetan players. It's a foul there maybe on Tenzin Namgyal. Saying jo Dorje is pleading his case. in Namgyal just struggling on the deck might have twisted his knee the challenge Asking for the yellow card. To get confirmation whether the referee has booked any of the one Ladakh players in the aftermath of that. And then Dondup urging his players forward. It's a good header out there by Mohamed Ahmad, getting a lot of distance. Referee has blown for half time here at the open stadium in Spitok Lay. It is 1 0 to 1 Ladakh. Courtesy of a goal from Sering Dorje, giving 1 Ladakh a crucial win, crucial goal here in this first half. Look at the stats here. One Ladakh. Just shading possession. 55% to Tibetan NSA is 45. See one Ladakh with more shots. Three to Tibetan NSA is one. One Ladakh have created a lot more chances. The crucial scoreline remains one at the top. We have one Ladakh. Scored just the one goal. Tibetan NSA have a chance get back into this game. It is half time 
here on day three of the Climate Cup between one Ladakh and Tibetan NSA, one Ladakh, one Tibetan NSA nil.
And we're back on the way for the second half between Mon Ladakh and Tibetan NSA here at the Open Stadium in Spitok Lay. Referee kicks things off. Mon Ladakh will now kick from right to left. It's a good bit of play there. Ladakh just keeping possession. Don't have to force the issue here. What they have to make sure is they do not concede any sloppy goals. It's a good pass here. And the goalkeeper off his line. Very well done. Tibetan now. Resume once again. The right hand side. Segal. So very important header by Tenzin Dondon. Segal looks for the long ball. The ball somehow breaks. He's gone for the strike there. It's high and wide have been looking for the pass but he just completely overhits it Amadar just organizing his troops kicks it long two players have left it completely as not very a very wise move there. Just let the ball bounce. Both players not taking responsibility. They weren't punished. Ben Nancy will take the throw in. Good header out there by Mohammed Hamad. Now one Ladakh can break. He's got a couple of players in support. He just slows it down. That's really smart play. Now on the left hand side, he's gone for the pass, he's looked up and it's gathered by the goalkeeper, Tenzin Samdup. Swangdak Dorji now. It's a very loose touch but he's done very well to keep the ball in. Himal Lundup does well but the ball now hooked straight into the hands of the goalkeeper. Tibetan NSA shown glimpses and moments but they haven't stitched together enough to trouble one Ladakh as of yet it's good control on the touch line Zubair Bashir looking up to find the right option he does on the right hand side now one Ladakh trying to attack down that right hand flank Tenzin Don loops lets the ball run for a goal kick Tenzin Dondon now driving with the ball, feeds it into midfield. A quick bit of play. The goalkeeper very, very proactive. As he stayed within the lines. Ahmad Dar, he's looking puzzled as well. If he has caught this outside of the box, he will risk getting a red card. Saying the ball was caught, but he did land. His feet went outside the line. If that's the case, the goalkeeper is very fortunate not to be booked there. Tibet and NSA have a free kick in a very dangerous area, once again, out of absolutely nothing. On Ladakh, you'll see concentration at the back. The tide of this game could have been turned. The referee took stricter action there. Hema Lundup deciding not to take the free kick. It's 
the ball. He gets the ball here. He's got a chance, but his control lets him down. He's taken the strike. There's a bit of confusion here, but Onladak looks to break away. Japan NSA puts the ball in, but it's good defending by Onladak once again. Mohamed Ahmad, Pirius at the back. been a foul there by Zubair Bashir catching Tenzin Namgyal already jumped could not withdraw from the challenge Another free kick for Tibetan NSA Sam it is Pemalando who will take the free kick it into the far post the goalkeeper looks to punch it there don't know if it was the smartest decision he gets enough purchase on it and one of that clears goalkeeper looked to be very decisive there and come out and punch but they have a throw in now to bet an NSA to check the health of Muhammad Hamad first. Tenzin don't look with the throw in. Can we look to launch the ball into the box? The click on header. Bundu once again, he goes for the strike. It's well defended. Brave defending there to block the shot. Awan Ladakh looking to break. Ball just not breaking for Awan Ladakh here. Will now. Rebar battling on the right hand side. <laughs> He's absolutely clattered. One of our presenters with the strike there. It's a foul on Tenzin Namgyal. Referee will produce the yellow card. And he has. Confirmation that Mehran Hilal Dar has picked up the yellow card. You can see here. Try to clear the ball and he hits a presenter, knocks the phone out of his hand. But no harm, no foul. Too close to the action. Got to keep your eyes on the ball at all times. Here's a free kick now. Had to clear by Hilal Dar. It is a corner. But Nanase gathering some momentum, launching balls in dangerous areas. This time they will hope to make it count via this corner. As Lunda put the ball in. It's a good header and it's a goal. It's 1 1. It is the wise captain, Tenzin Donden, with the header. Which gave Furkan Ahmadar no chance. And Tibetan NSA have rolled back into this game. Race through the corner. You can see Paul in the box. Is there a foul there in the build up? There is confirmation, it is 1-1 one, one. and Tibetan NSA getting the opportunity they have been craving for all game and they have punished one Ladakh.
of support in the stands. It looks like Tibetan NSA's flag. Man Ladakh. Players still pleading the case, asking for a foul. One of the dark players urged to continue now, stop the appeals. Now one Ladakh will have to go again. A lot of time to finally kick off. Once again, 56th minute. One one. This game is suddenly burst into life. Both teams having an opportunity to play the final against LEFC. Yes, PM up now. Finds Sering on the right hand side. Chops inside onto his left foot. He plays the ball onto his right hand right foot, but not finding his target. Here's Gawang Chokli with the ball in. It's a good header, it's a good save by the goalkeeper. Great bit of play there by Tibetian, suddenly bursting into life after scoring that goal. Renewed energy. Chokli putting the ball in. It's a good header. By Penpa Sering. Lacking the direction. Now one Ladakh can break now. It's a good header on the left hand side. Gawang Chokli. Ends in Namgyal. Looks for the switch. Finds Sering. Here's Segyal. Out of Dorji now. He's under a bit of pressure but does really well to keep the ball. Here's Namgyal. On his left foot finds the pass. Very composed bit of play here. By Tibetan NSA. Pemal Lundup just trying to accelerate the pace of the passing. It's a long clearance here. Lot to do there as he's done extremely well. Arif Hussain, he's done outstandingly well to keep the ball. It's a risky challenge, but one Ladakh. That was a sensational pass, or attempted pass, I would say. Again, on that outside of the right boot. But Tenzin Samdup easily gathers. Samdup clears the ball. Need away. Again, the ball just not hitting the deck for a long time. Both teams just hacking the ball to clear it. Lebar not happy. Thought he should have got the ball there. Here's a throw in for one Ladakh. Sevang Rahula just making sure his teammates are in position for the throw in. Looks like a foul throw there. The referee says play on. Again, battling on the touchline. Beautiful pass over the top. Here's Penpa Sering. He's got support. 
Looks for the one two. He has spent pursuing. It's good defending there by Mohammad Ahmad. Coming across, taking no chances. It's a lovely one two. By the Tibetan players, Sering getting the pass back. But Mohammad Ahmad taking no chances. It is a corner for Tibetan NSA. One Ladakh really need to switch on here. Conceded the last corner. Nando put the ball in. The ball is allowed to bounce here. There was a chance. Would have probably caught the hand there of one of the Tibetan players. And one Ladakh escape. Corners by Pema Lundup. Exactly what you want from your set piece taker. Plenty of height, plenty of pace on it. Good bit of play there by Hendon Sering. Lundup will do really well to keep the ball in. He has. Now he whips the ball into the box. It's brilliant. And one Ladakh have to clear the ball away. It is another corner for Tibetan NSA. How the momentum of this game has shifted after Tibetan scored that goal. Suddenly it's one Ladakh on the back foot. The pressure of this game really telling on both sets of players. Lundup will whip the ball in. It's a f almost a free header there. The goalkeeper was in no man's land. Amadar will be very happy to see the ball sail over his crossbar. Again, a couple of players spare there. Now one Ladakh look to break here. Space here on the left hand side. There's Amadar. Has he kept that in? He probably hasn't. The referee said he did, and his teammates had every right to be frustrated there. If he did manage to keep that in, there was a chance to cut the ball back. It could have resulted in an easy tap in. But Ahmad Dar went for the shot and said he's won the corner, but one Ladakh could have very easily been in front. The striker picked his head up and went for the pass. Here's Rebar with the corner. The keeper just loses the ball there, and it is a th goal kick. Could have been a costly error. Ball slipping through the goalkeeper's hands. Just taking his time. Goes long. It's a very commanding header by Zubair Bashir. Not the same. Good header. Great feet. Finds the pass, but he cannot find the pass. Did the first bit really well. Turned away from trouble. His pass not matching his skill. Throw in for Tibetan. They will retake and reload. Coach of one Ladakh. Be wondering how this game has turned after we were in control. That's what happens when you concede a goal. The momentum completely shifts. The team has scored the goal. Now Wan Ladakh trying to regain some of that momentum which they had in abundance in the first half. 
Referee is brandishing a yellow card here. Tenzin Donden, who has picked up the yellow card. Ahmad will to launch the ball into the box. It's well headed out. Bashir trying to hook the ball back in. Both players indecisive there. Awkward bounce. And there was time there to probably take a touch, maybe control the ball on his chest. Went for the flick on header instead. And Samdup will easily claim it. And goes for the long clearance. Rola will be a little bit disappointed to concede the throw in. He had nobody around him to take a touch decided to hit the ball away instead Rawan Chokli has gone around the bench to pick the ball of his choice it's a long throw good control the clearance is not completed might be offside he is too eager to go past the defensive line. Clearance out onto the left hand side. No one Ladakh can break. It's a good tackle. Madari Hussain does really well. Then Dorje now cutting on his right side, right foot. Subair Bashir tried to burst through. Ball still not clear. One Ladakh having a chance. He's a ball whipped in. It's a good save there by the goalkeeper. One Ladakh having a couple of opportunities. Tibetan trying to launch a quick attack. Bashir just lays it off. Very well done there. The right back Rahula. Both players getting in their way and just surrendering possession. It's the kind of sloppiness you want to avoid. 20 minutes or so remaining. He's done really well to roll in Pema Lundup. Now he look to deliver. Doesn't rush it and take the corner instead. I'm just waiting for the cavalry to arrive to the box. Lundup has the go ahead to whip this ball into the box. It's an easy gather for the goalkeeper. It's a missed opportunity for Tibetan. And now one Ladakh can break here. It's a great bit of pace shown. And now he has a couple of players in support. If he can find it, he has. It's two on one here for Tibetan. The pass is perfect. He's just dragged it a little bit wide. Arif Hussain. It's a big chance there for one Ladakh on the break. Really had players in support. On the right pass as well. We have a couple of pitch invaders. Home of dogs. There's a chance there for one Ladakh. Here's the drinks break for the second half.
back on the way. Final 17 or so minutes plus stoppage time. Both teams still looking for that winner. It's a lovely pass by Ahmad. Miscontrolled. in Hansen Sepak looks for the long diagonal but it's well defended by Gawang Chokli Trying to play out the back. A little bit more composure. Tanzan Wang Dan. Zubair Bashir loses out. For Spen Sering, who it's a really good bit of play there at Tanzan Namgyal. And now Tibetan NSA have a chance to put the ball into the box here on the left hand side. As Pema Lundup looks up, tries to take the shot, but it's dribbled. Harmlessly past the goalkeeper. Take a deflection on its way. It has, it has, you know. It is a corner. Tibetan NSA threatening now. More and more set pieces. On Ladakh have to be very, very careful. Defending their own half their own box. Ball whipped in, it's a good header out there. Now one Ladakh can break. Great pace shown, but he can't keep the ball in. Unlucky. Stands in Wang Dan. Really showing great pace. This is the business end of the match. Both teams locked level. Stamina is going to play a huge part to see who's going to come out on top. Again, just altitude, 11,000 feet. It's difficult conditions for the players. Really giving a good account of themselves and the team. And then Segia will take this throw in. It's a good flick on there, but it's well headed out by Mamad Ahmad. It's a throw in. Just avoided. Going out for a corner. Segia now launch this ball into the box. Almost like a corner, this. Again, Mamad Ahmad first to it. Really commanding, defending by the center half. It's a good bit of play. Ken takes a deflection. It's another throw in. Segyal going all the way back to throw this ball. Into the box once again. Onto the box. So once again, it's Hamad. Does clear. And that's maybe not the wisest move there by Segyar. He should have just left it and thrown the ball again. Instead, he went to control it. And lost the ball. Now, one Ladakh will look to launch an attack. Has to be very careful there. He's lost the ball out. It's a big chance here. But it's a crucial header. Lundup goes for the shot. He sliced it wide. Again, might be tired minds, tired bodies that lead to such errant decision making. Where is Mohammad Ahmad? Stands in Wangdan into a tight corner. Just 
helps it around the corner. Into Arif Hussain, but he cannot keep the ball in. Gail once again will throw the ball to Snam Gyal who just helps the ball up to the forward line to Ben Passering but does not find its way. Again, you can see the approach being the same to Ben Passering, just help the ball to the channel and his pace will take him through. He has a chance here for Tibetian now. Defender just leaving his leg out. He's a big chance for Pema Lundup and he smashed it in. The skipper. That is called a captain's goal. He lashes it home on his left foot. And Tibetan NSA, courtesy of their captain, have pulled this game out from 1-0 down to now lead 2-1. 80 minutes on the clock. It was really good play. Again, Penpa Sering stretching the defense. Pass to Pema Lundup was perfect. And the finish was emphatic. What a turnaround this has been. And as it stands, Tibetan NSA will face Delhi FC in the final. Incredible turnaround, great courage and determination shown by the Tibetan NSA players. The first half not going their way. The attitude completely changed in the second half. They have been rewarded. It's a foul there. Tibetan can continue. Here's Sering. Again, opting to just keep the ball. Smart play there. Now, looking for the clearance up front. Still a player on the deck. We'll have to get up as soon as possible. Again, it's a very errant touch, which has led to a corner. The Pet NSA players are not happy. They wanted the play to stop. Instead, it is going to be a corner. 4 1 Ladakh. Crucial moment in this game. Still waiting for the one Ladakh players to join in to the box. Just the one player to aim at so far. It's very strange tactic here. Nasser Rebar just waiting for oh, he can whip the ball in. Bit of arguments in the box. A lot of afters. We don't want to see this. You can see Tenzin Sandup trying to get players sent off there. Goalkeeper. Starting a little bit of theatrics. Just kill the momentum of one Ladakh before this corner is taken. Ball's whipped in. So good defensive clearance. He's gone for the big volley here. Hamad with the shot, and it's a big chance. But he could not control the ball. It's Mohammed Hamad who whipped the ball back into the box. The control just letting him down. You can see. It was Tenzin Dorje who actually whipped the ball back into the danger area. Now 
Tibetan once again relieve the pressure try and find the third goal of their own there's a big chance here on the left hand side for Tuls from Dava but his touch is very very heavy now one Ladakh trying to get a move on here Looks like a foul there but plays on Good feet shown there on the right wing. Again, lovely feet. Tries to get away from the challenge. It is a throw in for Tibetan. throw in there plenty of distance heavy clash there on Doug Dorji on the deck setting Dorji as well both will carry on Yellow card. Wang Dadoji, the ball whipped in. It's headed away. It is a corner. Five minutes to go plus stoppage time. Wang Ladakh will need to score from one of these opportunities. It's the ball whipped in. Good clearance out there. Taking no prisoners, no chances. It's a lovely clearance actually finding him a Lundu who went for the spectacular. Doesn't catch the ball as cleanly as he would like to. Lundu recovers the ball as great feet. Midfield. By Wang Dak Dorji to feed the ball into the left hand side big throw in again there's a chance here for Penpa Sering it's a poke straight at the goalkeeper and for the toe poke effort. Now Wan Ladakh really busting her gut here to have one last attack. It's a great challenge there by Denzin Dondup. Really showcasing his class. Now it's, he's given it away very cheaply. His pen pass setting looks to find the pass, but he can't. As Mohammed Ahmad clears his Dorji. Good control there. Looks to find Sultrim Dava on the left hand side, but he's offside. minutes plus added on time for one Ladakh to get an equalizer it's a good play again tries to loop the ball it's good defending there by Tenzin Dondup really reading the situation correctly Clearance headed out. 
from Chokli doing really well to come away with the ball Toji fancy footwork but loses out and good bit of play here by Wan Ladak being very patient now he's put the ball in it's a big chance here but he's offside oh what a chance that would have been he was ready to pull the trigger there the referee coming to the aid of Tibetan NSA one minute plus stoppage time remaining again a very earned clearance by Mohamed Ahmad bit in haste goes to no man's land this is going to be a throw in for Tibetan NSA who will take their time he just likes to clear and then Sering just Kill time. Strike befriending. Attendant Segir. All whipped in. The goalkeeper is just happy to see that go over his crossbar. It is another corner. We have begun stoppage time. It is going to be a corner for one Ladakh. Probably the last chance. It's the ball into the box. It's a good punch out by the goalkeeper. He's very decisive. Took matter into his own hands, literally. It is going to be a goal kick. It's a foul there on the goalkeeper. Mohamed Ahmad is not happy with the referee. He feels that it was, should have been another corner. Ready for the corner. It's the ball whipped in. It's a good header out there by Tenzin Namgyal. Again, very good defending. This time by Gawang Chokli. Really putting their bodies on the line here. Gawang Chokli really feeling that. As it stands, Tibetan NSA will go through, courtesy of their skipper, Pema Lundup's fantastic finish. The 80th minute. Is the ball whipped into the box? Is a chance? It's easily into the hands of the goalkeeper, who will take his time, run the clock down. Lundup tries to it's got a bit of play on the right hand side throw in for one Ladakh Three minutes of stoppage time already been played. 
It's good defending there by Penpa Sering, really helping out his defenders. And the ball here is a big chance, but is again offside. Cannot believe it. Asra Rebar was convinced that he beat the offside trap. The linesman was very quick to raise the flag. Asra Rebar has picked up a yellow card for dissent. Went straight to the linesman to protest. The referee is warning him that he'll pick up a red card, which is pretty much academic at this point. You have to keep the discipline here. It's very easy to lose composure. The stakes are high. It's a big clearance down the field. Headed by Mamad Ahmad. Good header there by Wang Dak Torji. Very, very composed. Now goes for the big switch. I'm not sure that's very good play there by Tibetan NSA. They have possession of the ball and they just surrender it by putting it down the field, allowing one Ladakh to, to launch another attack. Space here on the right hand side. And your body streaming forward to clear the ball here. And now Tibetan NSA can launch a counter attack. It's two on three. It's a strong challenge. Brilliant bit of play. Sultum Dawa had to surrender possession there. Driving into the midfield, he slipped the ball in, he went for the return pass. He had a lot of space behind him. If he had just looked up, he went for the one-two, which is the unselfish option. But my goodness me, if he had just turned, he was through on goal. Huge let off for Tibetan NSA. As we draw close to the end of the game, and then summed up. He's going to take complete control of this free kick, take his time and boot this as far as possible down the field. There's a red card here for somebody on the bench. Somebody from one Ladakh has picked up a red card. Looks like it is Sewang Norbu who has picked up the red card there. I think even the officials are losing their cool. I think they have been provocated far too much in this game. They're not happy. Some of the reactions here. This is very unsavory scenes. Heat of the battle. It's now one Ladakh's coaches, manager getting involved. We're eight minutes into stoppage time. Half of this time is gone. To calming both benches. You can see the referee calming the linesman down. That's a sight you don't see very often.
referee asking the game to continue. Played nearly nine minutes of stoppage time. Keeper attends and summed up, just making sure that he's got the go-ahead, take this free kick, and he has. And Tibetan taking the chances there, he was very lucky that he got away with it. On Ladakh, could have been through on goal of the pass. Was astray, and again now, Tenzin Dondup taking absolutely no chances of prisoners then boots it into the stands. It's truly the last chance for one Ladakh here. Looks up, it's well worked on the right hand side. It's good defending. Now Wang Dak Doji could come away with the ball. It's good defending by Mohammed Ahmed. Mohammed looks for the big switch onto the left hand side. It's a smashing pass. He's done really well to keep the ball in. Swift the ball into the box. It's it's somehow stayed out. It's an unbelievable opportunity right at the death. Goes to Astra Rebar. Pass on the left hand side it was absolutely on the money by Ahmad Dar. Tibetan NSA. Get away with that. Played 100 minutes on the clock. Sandup taking his sweet time. Sandup smashes the ball down the field. It's a good flick on there. Tibetian still committing men forward. Now one Ladakh can break one final time. It's a good challenge there. The referee deems that as a foul. Another chance for one Ladakh to launch the ball into the box. Tibetan NSA haven't managed the latter part of the stoppage time especially very well. They've given one Ladakh opportunities. This stands in Wang Dan who's going to whip the ball in. It's a good header by Mohamed Hamad, but it should be easily gathered by the goalkeeper, and it is. It's another substitution, Sering Chomfel coming on for Tenzin Sering. And Pema Tashi coming on for Penpa Sering. It's clearance, and the referee blows the full time whistle. It is Tibetan NSA who have prevailed after going a goal down. They come up victorious 2-1, this crucial encounter. And they will now play Delhi FC in the final of the Climate Cup 2023 here at the Open Stadium. It's a fantastic battle between both teams. It's ebb and flow in the game. One Ladakh taking the lead. Tibetan NSA roaring back from that corner. And then was the skipper, Pema Lundup. Smashed the ball in on his left hand, left foot to give his team the victory. Great scenes here. One Ladakh opening the scoring in the 23rd minute. To Sering Dorje it was Tenzin Dondin's header in the second half. Of course, Pema Dundup. See how second half has really turned on his head with Tibetan NSA, 65% of the ball, more shots than one Ladakh. 
really stepped up the game in the second half. And it is full time here at the Climate Cup on day three. It is one Ladakh one, Tibetan NSA two.
and we have reached the full time here at Open Spiduk Stadium Le. What an amazing match we saw where Tibetan NSA took the lead in the second half and went on to win the game and take their place in the final. So Musaev, another prediction going wrong. What do you have to say? How did Tibetan team prove you wrong? Well, it was a battle of the great players. You know, the, both the team played very well and the players were really into the touch and talking about Tibetan NSA, you know, the players, the formation, the attacking, the goalkeeper, the saves, everything was to the point. So it was a great match. Yeah, I think so Tibetan NSA worked efficiently and took their chances where when Ladakh FC had their shortcomings in True. converting their chances into goals, right? True. So, a final between Tibetan NSA and Delhi FC, what do you have to say? It's going to be a great battle, you know, though Delhi have de uh, defeated Tibetan uh, in the previous game, but I think uh, Tibetan NSA can come back and show their uh, full potential game. Alright Musab, let's go to the award ceremony. I would like to call Joint Director of Sports and Youth, UT Ladakh, to give the man of the match to Tibetan NSA's number 10, Mr. Pema. Uh, it was a sad day for the dark team, sir. But yeah. I think it is a good exposure to them playing against teams who have played foreign teams who have played in I League. What are your thoughts on today's match and both mm. matches? Uh, it was a fantastic match. Uh, at the end, I guess football won, and of course we lost. But then it's you know what we are learning as we go by. So this is a good opportunity for our team, both Ladakh FC and UT Ladakh team. So we are playing with good uh, teams. So we hope to learn from it and you know uh, do it better in the next time. All right, sir. One last question. Any message to both the Ladakhi teams that played today? Don't lose hope. I mean, we have just started. You know. We are a new UT, we have just started our team, we have just started our formation. So we are doing all our, you know, whatever we could in terms of infrastructure, exposure. So in the years to come, the trophy would surely be ours. All right, sir. Thank you so much. I would not take much of your time. Now I would like to call our man of the match, man of the hour, number 10 from Tibetan NSA. Thank you, so, man of the match and taking the place in final, how does it feel? Uh, first of all, like, uh, it's such an honor for all of the Tibetan people because uh, like we have created the history because until now we haven't reached in such a tournament at final so I want to dedicate this final to all the Tibetan supporters to all the Tibetan people who are here and especially for the Tibetan people who are inside the Tibet. Alright man your first match was against Delhi FC which didn't go your way and now is there any revenge on the cards of what how is team thinking about the next match? So. Uh, the f about the first match, we were not lacking behind. Uh, the thing is, like we got an early red card, so which uh, caused our match tactically a little bit like weak. So yeah, for the final, we are going to give 100 percent, and I think uh, the cards going to get changed now. All right, man! Congratulations on your man of the match. See you on the final on 7th of September. Till then, all the best. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you. That is it, guys, from post-match presentation. Over to you, Suraj, in commentary box.